Yo what is up guys welcome back to a brand new video and today is another exciting one because Yuzu finally released the BCR early access update which um, BCR stands for buffer cache rewrite we already had a texture cache rewrite I'm not sure if I did a video on that but I did make a video on them implementing 4JIT instead of 1JIT, so it was more efficient, uh, especially with RAM. So anyways, buffer cache rewrite will increase performance, better rendering, and stability improvements, question mark. Now, before we read into this, make sure to like the video and subscribe. It really helps me out, road to 20K. But yeah, anyways, if we go to their article and scroll down, which you can read all of this, just go to their Twitter or to this link. As you can see, textures, less glitching, but this is the most important part of today's video. They tested this with a 3070, which is a really good card, a i7 10700K, which is also a really good CPU. So keep that in mind, but green is the old buffer cache and blue is the new buffer cache. So as you can see, here we have like a 20 FPS, I'm guessing. Doesn't actually say what this is, but maybe in percent. 20% or FPS increase, 14%, 9%, 16%, 20%, 20%, and 31%. And here we have 16% improvement over the old buffer cache. So that on itself is really good, especially if you look at the games. Animal Crossing, Breath of the Wild, and especially Super Mario Odyssey have a big change. And those are some big titles as well. So that is very nice. Now this is on a NVIDIA card, obviously, on OpenGL. Some people don't have NVIDIA and they use Vulkan. So they posted this. This system has a Ryzen 5 3400G and a AMD Radeon RX 550. So red is the old cache and blue is the new cache. Now here we have a 10% improvement. I'll just call it percent because I still don't know. A 7% improvement, a 15% improvement, a 9% improvement, and a 9% improvement. So even on Vulkan on AMD gear, uh, there is improvement. So that is very nice to see uh, improvement on both sides because not everyone has, you know, NVIDIA cards. Also, AMD Vega based integrated GPU, so the ones that are in your CPU, uh, mostly on laptops, show up to a 223% increase on Paper Mario Origami King. That is really interesting. So if anyone of you has a integrated AMD GPU, please try this out for me. Go to my Discord server to get both the non-BCR or just get regular Yuzu and get the BCR version, also link down below for BCR version. And please test it out and tell me in the comments, anyone, tell me in the comments how big of a difference this makes for you, because I'm really interested. I'll be testing it myself in this video, but I would love to hear from you guys as well. Now, obviously this is very new, they say it. Uh, so if there's any problems, uh, don't worry, it might be fixed pretty soon. Without further ado, let's test it for ourselves. All right, I just wanted to mention before we get into the testing I did in this video, I did not test with Vulkan. Now I'm using Vulkan, so let's do Vulkan testing first. Now my CPU is being used about 40 to 42 uh, percent. My GPU is getting used about 38 to 42 percent. And my RAM usage right now is 9.4 gigabytes. Now keep in mind, I am recording on OBS, which I'm also going to say in the video. My GPU usage was already like 30% at least while I'm recording this. Uh, same with my CPU using 15% and my RAM was about 7.8 gigabytes of RAM. Could be less now. So yeah, keep that in mind. This is not all just from Yuzu. I'm recording, I'm opening stuff. You know how it is. So yeah, 41 to 42% CPU, 38% GPU, that's what we're going to get it at, and 9.6 gigabytes of RAM. Now let's go to the CBR build on Vulkan. All right, so CBR build looking like 50% CPU, 9.5 gigabytes of RAM, and about 43% GPU usage. Uh, but now let's go to Super Mario Odyssey because that is a game that was on the list. Also, my specs are down in the description. All right, so no CBR version. We are using 50% GPU, 40% CPU, almost 11 gigabytes of RAM in total. 
So yeah, we're basically locked at 59 FPS here, which was better than with OpenGL. Could be the fact that we don't have shader cache uh, much for this game anyway. But yeah, let's move on to the CBR version. I mean BCR. <laughs> All right, so uh, for me, it looking it's not looking too good on Vulkan either. Uh, you'll see what I mean. But yeah, we're running at 51 FPS here with BCR. Uh, and my GPU is at 64, 65%. My RAM usage is 10.8 gigabytes. My CPU is about 35% in usage. So obviously that is not what we like to see, but they did say some systems do not get better performance from this so i might be one of those systems plus the fact that it's really new so they might fix this in the, the soon future so, uh yeah that's my uh vulcan testing back to the video now let's first test without bcr now the way i'm gonna test this is see how much cpu gpu and ram is getting used what i'm gonna do is just like in the previous performance update video i made i'm gonna go into pokemon sword and just get a still scene and see how much percent cpu and gpu is used also if you want to know how to play these games watch my tutorials all right so this is going to be my save point i have to blur part of the video but you should get the point though uh it's static 30 fps we're getting 31 percent usage on the cpu and keep in mind i also have obs running and i have other stuff open like google chrome so yeah 15.2 gigabytes of RAM in use right now and 65% GPU, which obviously I'm running OBS, blah, blah, blah. You heard it. But yeah, so that's basically the baseline here. So I would say let's move on to the BCR version. Interesting for me, it's actually slower for some reason. It is using around 48 GPU and CPU around 60, I would say. But as you can see, my game is running at 24 FPS, which is very odd. They did say on some systems, this won't improve performance. So I might be one of those systems. That would be a bummer for this video. <laughs> okay, very interesting. It is still the same. Okay, well then let's just go to a part where I have 30. Let's just see what it uses here when it's actually 30. 50% GPU and about 50% CPU. 15 gigabytes of RAM are in use right now. And try the non-BCR version and see if we have a difference. So 50, 50 and 15. So that's pretty easy to remember. Obviously, they did not mention Pokemon Sword on the performance graph, so yeah, but this is the game I play most of the time, so obviously I'm going to test it with this. Very interesting. CPU usage is only 26% and GPU is about 53%, I would say. 50.1 gigabytes of RAM used, so for me, this is actually a downgrade, which is weird. As I said, they didn't test this on this game. Also, I might be one of those systems that doesn't improve. I don't know. Let's try a game they actually put in the tests. Okay, I don't really have a big shader cache for Super Mario Odyssey, but we're gonna try it anyway. All right, so this is the non-CBR version. We're using 79% of my GPU, about 51% of my CPU, and 11.5 gigabytes of RAM. Now, this is pretty stabilized right now. Let's just call this a day. We have 51 FPS uh, average. So yeah, let's see with CBR now. All right, so far seeing almost 60 FPS, but I feel like we were something like this, weren't we? 58 FPS, all right. Uh, our usage is about the same, I would say, but we have a little more FPS, like the extra five FPS we were missing. Now, obviously I have some headroom on my CPU and my GPU and my RAM. So they could definitely improve it. We're basically locked at 58, 59 FPS, I would say. So yeah, obviously I don't have sh like shader cache for this. So that's probably why it's not smooth. But again, it's probably my system. If you have an AMD integrated GPU, let me know, please. Because I only have one test bench and that is this computer. Also keep in mind, even without Yuzu, my GPU was used 
for 36% and my CPU for 15% because I'm recording, etc. But anyways, I guess that is all for me. Uh, sorry I couldn't showcase this any better. I only have one system to test with. Let me know if this worked better for you in the comments. I would appreciate it. And uh, yeah, as I said at the start of the video, please subscribe. We're going for 20k. And like the video if you enjoyed anyways. Again, download link in the description. If it doesn't work, join the Discord server. And uh, yeah, that's all for me. Peace out, guys. Peace. Sad.